Okay, welcome back for more Chrono Trigger. I was I love was freaking out there, but there's a crate right in the middle of the crater. That is kind of weird. Lava is very fast, deep under Earth already. This gate was made by Lavos. Maybe Lavos is the source of all gates. What's wrong, Krona? Fight Lavos? Go in here, yes? Can I switch now? Oh, yeah. Uh, let's take Luca. Why not? I like having Krono, Marl, and Luca as my party. I don't know. I don't know about you guys. So we go into the time portal, and instead of finding lavas, we find a cave. <laughs> Boy, this is exciting! Well, it is the gate nearest to lavas. We have no idea as to where it leads. It's kind of frozen in here. Well, according to our time, uh, whatever you want to call it, actually, I know Robo calls it a time gyro or something like that. We are in the 12,000 BC, quite a long time after the events in the prehistoric. And as you can see, it's kind of frozen in here. The Ice Age, as Azala has predicted, has happened, and it's still taking place. But there are signs of life, of it, of advanced life, in fact. What is this? Ooh! Ah! You hear that track? This is my favorite track. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the Dark Ages. Why are they called the Dark Ages? I'll let you find out that one on your own, so just pay attention. But we are now in, well, <laughs> the Enlightened Civilization. Simply put, look at it. It's amazing. It's so... Luxur luxurious, it's so advanced. Let's have a chat with these people, see what's going on. Welcome to Enhasa, in the magical kingdom of Zeal. We find truth in the bliss of sleep. Dear me, and who might you be? What strange visitors! Welcome to Zeal. Is this part of a dream? Queen Zeal rules our magical kingdom. She is without peer in beauty and greatness. The queen has given us everything. After the king died, she nurtured magic, which has advanced the kingdom. So it has. Who's this fellow, anyway? This is the eternal kingdom of zeal, their dreams can come true, but at what price? Hmm, that's a good question. Oh, here's another one of these guys. Am I a butterfly dreaming I'm a man? Or a bowling ball dreaming I'm a plate of sashimi? <laughs> what kind of question is that? <laughs> Never assume that what you see and feel is real. Hey, it's a... it's a goat. Do you believe in fate? Which means our lives are all predetermined? Well... I wonder what he says when you say yes. So you're a believer. Yes, it is useless for us to fight destiny. Huh, okay. What else does he say? I don't have time for this. Ah, oh, okay. He doesn't say... He doesn't respond afterwards. Hmm. 
Well, if you say no, you don't believe in fate, he also sympathizes with you. So, I guess he's just a sucker. <laughs> Truths exist in dreams. Alright. What's this? Huh, it's a book. Interesting. Guess I'll leave it open. Let all the water out. The city of Kajar, where we study magic, lies on the edge of a western continent. The airship Blackbird is kept there. Must be significant. Hey, who's this? You know, I get this feeling that I've seen him somewhere before. Hey, what's wrong? You have something to say? What's wrong with him? What a weird kid. The black wind howls. One among you will shortly perish. Hey, explain yourself. What, an out of the blue like that? Chrono, this is kind of creepy. It's only a bad joke. It's unscientific. Black wind. There was another person who mentioned that. Anyway, these tabs here on the floor are springs of recovery. Just basically healing spots. Step on them, and you'll heal. Wonder what's inside the North Palace. I bet there's a key to it in the palace. But the entry is strictly pro prohibited or forbidden. The Queen's Palace is at the center of zeal. From there, she protects the entire world. That's why we can sleep our days away. That's cool. <laughs> what would... Oh. Oh, look at that. <laughs> yeah, I knew what the books were up for. I already figured out this little mystery. Opening up the books in the correct sequence, which is water, wind, and fire, will open up secret passages, which allow you to read some weird books and find items. Or in this case, a sleeping new. The Mystery of Life. All life begins with new and ends with new. This is the truth. This is my belief. At least for now. Okay. The guru of reason is gone. Challenge me? Okay. Why not? You wanna get challenged? You'll get it. You want it? You'll get it. I've defeated many news before this. I know how this is done. I will destroy you. I will destroy Butthole. Wish I had better Antipod. Antipod 3 attacks everyone. Looks like Antipod 2 just attacks people in close proximity. <laughs> better than regular Antipod. Oh yes. Good damage. I love that fucking thing. Oh! Oh, damn! Oi! Cut that out! You better not do this shit! Charge up those attacks quick! Okay, antipod number two, please. What? Why can't I target? All three of them, they're close enough! What the fuck, dude? <laughs> That's dumb. Oh well, two will be good enough, I guess. Still, that's kind of stupid. Why couldn't I target them all three? They were close enough. The news looks so stupid. What's he do? No! What? He didn't do anything. <laughs> well, that was pointless. You are a stupid, stupid no. Hope you die. Bam. That wasn't much of a challenge. He fucked up. You are strong. Take this. Ah, oh, magic tab and the speed tab. And then he noos out of existence. 
Well, I could use both of those tabs. Magic tab shall go to Luca. While the speed tab... Well, who could use some speed? Not you. Not... not really you. No. Robo could definitely use it. I'm gonna be using Robo, so I'll... At some point, that is. So I'll keep the speed tab for now. Whenever I get him in my party, I'll use the speed tab on him. Oh wait, that's the mystery of life. I already read that. I love the music that plays in this place. It really makes this uh, whole kingdom so enchanting and interesting to visit. The queen has sealed the elemental weapons in the North Palace. You can see its entrance on the northern continent, but no one is allowed there. Hey, wait a minute. It's the same blue pyramid we saw earlier. Much earlier in the playthrough, in fact. Holy shit. Here we go. Hey, who's this? I am Doreen. Seek the hidden path and open the doors of knowledge, each in turn. Okay. The door to the North Palace is sealed with a mysterious energy. Even we, the enlightened ones, cannot open it. What you got? Ethers! Oh my god! They actually have them! Where have they all been all this time? <laughs> About fucking time, Jesus. You'd think they've been rendered extinct or something. Why are they so difficult to find? It's insanity. Well, we explored everything around here. Guess we'll take this. No, I guess it teleports us back down. Well, this is a land bridge, I suppose. Makes sense. So let's take the land bridge. And, uh... Find ourselves another way up. Oh, here we go. That didn't take long. I'm fiddling a bit with the sound uh, volume. Because this area seems to be a bit lower on volume. Let's uh, try fiddling a bit again. 50 should do. I don't know why this track is... In lower volume. Weird. Alright, we made it onto the main continent. Pretty cool place. Probably a lot bigger than what it looks like. And that down there, I believe, is the Sun Keep. But there's no way to get to it. Oh, and this is Kajar. This is the magical city of Kajar. We do experimental. We do experiments. Not experimental. For the queen. Alright. Your power differs from ours. In you I sense a strange aura of kindness. You call that strange? I call that normal. <laughs> What's this? Oh, it's the wind book. Later. Combine the ancient rainbow shell and the sunstone to create incredible weapons and items. But now only the guru of life has the skill. Elemental power usage is forbidden. Ah, plants are so content. I wish I could be too. He's weird. <laughs> That's the sun keep you see on the southern continent. A sunstone, once the source of this world's power, was kept there. But when we began using our new energy source, it was sealed up just like the North Palace. We claim we don't need the energy of this tired old planet. Well, definitely old, but tired? Maybe not. Maybe not yet. This new here is also a shop. The exact same one, actually. I've got load shields, but I cannot sell them unless the queen says it's okay. 
Hmm. That's a shame. His only friend other than his sister is that stupid cat. What tempest rages in his head? You mean that weirdo who told us that somebody's gonna die? Must be him. We've been seeing a lot of Janus lately. He appears upset and paces around. Oh yeah, see that shiny over there? I'll show you how to get it. Queen Zeal has two heirs, Shala and Janus. Shala is an incredible child who has extraordinary magical powers. Being so gifted, she'll breeze through life. One can only assume that Janus is not that uh, lucky. My, you've got an unusual aura, so you must possess the skill too. You must be very primitive compared to ours. You poor things. Hey, fuck you, okay? How did we come by our skills? And why do others lack them? Who cares? Wow. What a bunch of bastards. But by that uh, line, we can only assume that certain people in this time period are not capable of magic. And by default, don't live here. Another secret area we can pay a visit to. No fighting here, but there is a strange doll which causes a laugh. And you gain a black rock which was hidden inside. What's the black rock for? Uh, here it is. It's an accessory which invokes triple tech dark eternal. I've never used it. <laughs> Am I missing out? Would be nice to know. It all began eons ago when man's ancestors picked up a shard of a strange red rock. Its power, which was beyond human comprehension, cultivated dreams. In turn, love and hate were born. Only time will see how it all ends. Interesting. And who are the statues dedicated to? They don't look anything human. Those lacking magic have always lived beneath the clouds as the earthbound ones. After all, they lack what we have. Huh. Are you getting any vibes from this as uh, a, a veiled parallel between the rich and the poor? Because I am, and it's a pretty clever parallel. The Ocean Palace lies be deep beneath the waves. It's a symbol of the Queen's power. The palace is the source of light which sustains all living things. Queen Zeal the Great. The Earthbound ones are being allowed to work on the construction of the palace. So they do have a purpose after all. Wow, that's quite assholeish of him. <laughs> Indeed, that great aeroplane Blackbird, which Balthazar built. When it soars in the sky, it looks alive. Balthazar is truly a genius. The construction of the Ocean Palace is behind schedule. Eternal Palace beneath the waves. It'll be a sight to see when it's done. How do we get the shiny? Well, go up here. Walk up here, and bam! Speed tab. Now you got two speed. I heard Shalice's powers far exceed those of her mother. Then there's her stepbrother Janus. He's of royal blood, but he doesn't seem to have a speck of magic. Hmm. Odd. I'm working on a tab that will boost magical skill, but my precious products have been disappearing lately. Must be the naughty new that hid them. They love pranks. What can I do? What about this one? Oops, that's a defective item. Too bad, huh? 
I'll beat the shit out of you. <clears throat> I heard the strange prophet has come to the palace. I don't know the details, but I heard he has uncanny powers. Zeal's advances stem from a new energy source. Its power surpasses that of the elements. It's gotta be something special then. But what could possibly be better than that? The gurus of life, time and reason live in zeal. Their skill and knowledge is supreme. Well, they wouldn't be called gurus then, would they? Ah, if you talk to this new, he'll give you a hint about those books. Water summons wind, and wind makes fire dance. That's how you figure out to open up the books in that particular order. A guru once told me that the sunstone could store the almost infinite energy of our sun. But if its energy were used up, it would lose its glow and change into a moonstone. Hmm, interesting. Guess it's important to know. Did you know that a moonstone can be recharged if you leave it in the sun? But it takes eons, so it's unlikely for us to see that gorgeous glow again. Not unless you learn how to time travel, right? Well, I think we learned everything there is to learn in this area, so guess it's time to move on. Because while there are things to see and learn in Kusharin and Hasa, your destination is neither of the two. Your destination is the Queen's Palace. You need to access it by teleporting through these caverns. Oh, that track is so fucking beautiful. I love it. <laughs> 